Hi, I'm Lindsay Baumgren of Nourish Me Love, and this is your 30-minute full-body dumbbell workout. If you love strength training, drop a subscribe to our YouTube channel. All right, you guys, we are jumping right in. We got 30 minutes together, and all you're gonna need is some dumbbells. This is a strength-focused full-body workout. I have the amazing Rachel with me. Hi. Okay, Rachel's gonna be offering some modifications for the upper body. I'm coming back from knee surgery. I'm about 10 weeks, so I'll be offering modifications for the lower body. You can follow along with whatever moves work best for you. And we are pumped because today's workout is brought to you in partnership with the Northern Pulse Growers Association, which is a nonprofit association representing pulse growers in Montana and North Dakota. So Midwest represent, Woo! we're from <laughs> Minnesota, okay? So we're Minnesota, but those are our surrounding states, North Dakota and Montana. And true fact, did you know that 80 to 85% of all the pulses grown in the U.S. come from Montana and North Dakota. That's crazy. Right? Yeah. We're so close. We're getting them like <laughs> right poured into Minnesota. It's so awesome. All right, we're gonna talk more about pulses as we get into this workout because everyone's going, what are what pulses? Pulse? Right? Do you know what pulses are? This is gonna test you, okay? <laughs> See if you can play along with us as we jump into this workout. We'll chat more about it. But let me tell you what your workout looks like today. It's 30 minutes, you've got five circuits. It's done in our A, B, A format, which means each circuit has three moves, but the first one and the third one are the same move. You do those for 30 seconds of work followed by 10 seconds of rest. Move two is new move, and it's 45 seconds of work, 10 seconds of rest. So move two in the middle is longer, a, B, the A move is 30 seconds, but you're always getting 10 seconds of rest. We did this in a live workout and it was a true burner Burns. because 10 seconds of rest is like not a lot. <laughs> so grab your dumbbells. I have anywhere from 10 pounds up to 20 pounds. Choose whatever works for you. Drop the weights and use your body weight when you need to. Let's get started with warm up. You ready, Rach? Let's do warm it. Up. <laughs> all right, we go arms, legs, arms, legs, total body. So that's what you can expect today. So we're gonna hit it all. Let's start by warming it all up. Feet are stacked underneath my hips. Big inhale, reach up nice and tall. Exhale, baby back bend. Take it down and flap it out, flap it out, flap it out. Okay, so my left knee, which is technically for you guys, my right knee, is my surgery leg. So I'll be modifying there when I need to. I finally got my brace off, I'm pumped to move, but I definitely don't have that range of motion. So I'm gonna take it at my pace, you take it at yours, arms go out. Reach the fingertips towards me, shrug the shoulders up, roll it down. Reach your fingertips towards me, shrug it up, and roll it down. Two more, reach, shrug, and roll. Reach, shrug, and roll. Nice, now we're gonna go to a hinge reach and a squat reach. Baby, a little baby squat for me. Hinge reach and a squat reach. Just warming up the legs, warming up our back extensors, our spine, right? Reach those arms away from your body. Create length from fingertip to tailbone. Reach and reach. Can you get a little bit deeper in those squats each time? Nice, we're gonna do two more, two more right here. Reach, reach, last one. Give me the reach and the reach, take it to the back of your space, plank walk out. So you're gonna hinge over, there's that hinge. You're gonna walk out, find a high plank. Hold it here, nice work, let's walk it back in. Reach all the way up. Nice, warming up the hamstrings, the spine, the core, the shoulders, nice. Two more walkouts right here. Love a good little plank walk out. Great way to warm it up, inch warm it out. Nice, you could always take this up to an incline. Give me one more, you're gonna hold that plank, hold that plank, okay? Here we go, hold that plank. Two push-ups, if you can, knees or toes. Down, up, down, up. Hold it here, step the right foot outside the right hand. Easy twist, I'm so pumped to be able to do this with my surgery <laughs> knee, just like so Jack. So we're gonna be doing my favorite warm-up move right here. Other side outside, or other foot, left foot outside, left hand, easy twist. Nice, take it back, give me two more push-ups. Down, up, down, up. Let's do it again, right foot outside, right hand. Everyone's like, what's with the push-ups? I said 2023 was gonna be the year of push-ups. Year right? push-ups. Right? 2023 is the year of push-ups, guys. We're all gonna get better at them and you're gonna love it. <laughs> yes? Okay, now hold your plank. Let's do one more push-up, because you can. Down. <laughs> Everyone's like, no. There you go. Step your right foot between your hands, if you can. Find a nice isometric low lunge hold. Tuck your hips under. We're gonna be doing some isometric holds today. It's what we call the slow burn. Slow burn. So you're stretching through this hip flexor right here. You can reach this arm up and over. Just holding nice and low. Okay, I'm gonna get as low as I can, you get as low as you can. Nice, hold it here for three, two, and one. Take it down, step back, push back, down dog. Pedal the heels, big inhale up to the tiptoes. Exhale, melt the calf down to the ground. Nice, bring it back, high plank. Step the left leg through, low lunge. Come on up, hold it here. Tuck this tailbone towards me. Think about dropping that back knee to the mat. Mine's gonna be a little bit straighter because this is my bad leg. Nice, you can reach up and over. Open up through this hip flexor. Yes, hold it here, low lunge, low lunge. It's the slow burn, the slow burn for three, two. 
Let's go, plant the hands back down. Slow burpee, step in. So I set my right foot, my left foot, stand up, take it down, step back, switch that lead foot, go left, then right, stand up, take it down, step back, go with the right foot, right, left, take it up, one more, one more, lead with that left foot, go left, right, take it up, nice, let's jack it out if you can, tap it, tap it, option, tap, three jacks for eight, seven, six, you got it, five, four, three, two, one, hold those feet nice and wide, lateral squats, hit side, center, side, center, nice, toes face me or slightly turned out, I'm gonna baby, lateral lunge right there, so working on my lateral movements with this knee, push, off that bent knee, outer glutes. Side, center, side, center. Go for four, yes, three. Nice work, two, and one. You warm, Rachel? I'm warm. We're warm. Let's go. All right, team, jump in. I'm grabbing a quick sip of water, and we are jumping in to this workout. Circuit number one is arms, arms. Move A, you're on the ground. Single, single, double chest press. I'm gonna try and go heavy. Grab my 20s, take it to the ground. Single, single, double chest press, okay? And then we flip over, move two. It's a fun push-up. Yes, it's the year of push-ups, guys. <laughs> it's all about your push muscles, okay? My chest, shoulders, tries. Circuit one is all about the push muscles. So it's 30 seconds of a single, single, double chest press, okay? My elbows are not resting on the ground. There is constant tension. The back of my arm never touches the mat. If you're on a bench, go for a bench or a stability ball. You're gonna get a little bit more range of motion. Single, single, double chest press is move A. You do it for 30 seconds. In that 10 seconds of rest, you're gonna drop the weights and flip over to a high plank, yes? All right, team, ready? Let's go. Let's go. Get that chest press loaded. We go in three, two, let's go. Go single, single, give me double, double. Nice work. Single, single, and double, nice. So the back of the arms never touch the ground. There is constant tension on that chest, yes? Let's go, single. Single, it's only 30 seconds, go heavy, you're halfway. Come on, single, single, let's go for the double. There it is, right here, finish it. Nice work, guys, you're in the final. Five, let's get one more. Four, three, two, and you're out. Drop the weights off to the side, roll over. It is one push-up, one second plank. Two push-ups, two second plank, in three, two, let's go, 45 seconds. Give me one push-up, hold at the top for one. Give me two push-ups, down, up, down, up. Hold at the top for one and two. Go three push-ups, holy cow, this is hard. <laughs> After chest press, two, three. Hold the top of your plank for three, two, and one. Go four push-ups, let's go, four, three. Big exhale pushes you up, two, one. Hold at the top, hold for four, three, two, go one, go five push-ups. Five, uh, four, yes you can. Three, you're so strong. Two, and one, hold at the top. Hold for five, four, this is it. Three, two, and one. Whew. Back to chest press, single, single, double. Holy bananas, 30 seconds. Single, single, double chest press. Yeah, <laughs> three, two, let's go, go single, single. Double, I might be dropping these 20s. Holy <laughs> bananas, circuit one, push. This is your push circuit, upper body, chest, shoulders, triceps, they're on fire. Woo, let's go. Single, single, come on. Double, right here, single, single. Let's go, double. Yes, come on, you're in it for five, four, three, two. I'm gonna go one more double chest press. Nice work. Okay, you're gonna stay right here. I'm switching out, I'm going 15s. That is holy bananas hard. Same thing, single, single, double from the top. So you go single, single, double chest press. We go back into push-ups. You're there in three, two, let's go. Single. This format, Liz. Single, oh, it is just like this. The 10 second rest, circuit one. It's such a burner. That's why we're getting push-ups out of the way right away when you're fresh, yes? Come on, 30 seconds right here. I'm gonna do my best on the next set of push-ups. Ah, it's gonna burn, team. It's gonna burn, yes. What would it look like if I said 10 more seconds on these chest presses? Say yes, I, 10. Let's go. Constant tension, single, single, one more double, and you're out. Set the weights down, flip it. Okay, flip it. Whew. Oh, I'm Let's gonna go. do my best right here. 
Come on, let's go push-ups. One push-up, one second hold. Two push-ups, two second hold. It's 45 seconds and it starts in three. Oh, I'm not ready, Rachel. Okay. In two and one, let's go. One push-up, hold at the top for one. Two push-ups, down, up, down. Hold at the top, hold for one. And two, three push-ups, let's go. One, two, three. Hold at the top, hold for three, two, one. My form is suffering. To the knees we go for four. Come on, three, you got it. Two, let's go. Last one, hold that plank, hold for four. Three, two, one, five push-ups. I'm gonna drop to my knees for the push-ups. Five, four, pop to my toes for the plank. Three, two, <laughs> it's so hard. You're gonna hold that plank, hold it for five, four, three, Two, one, why? Because I feel so hard, Rachel. Muscle fatigue in the first circuit. We're not even done yet. <laughs> okay, back to single, single, double chest press. This is circuit one, close it out. You get a water break, guys. You get a water break, yes? Let's go. 30 seconds, single, single, double in three, two, let's go. I told you, this 10 second rest, how deceiving. Oh, my lanta. Single, single. I'm so excited to be done with chest, double. It's out. We go legs next, guys. Circuit two is legs. Here we go. Grit your teeth, close your eyes, get through it. Yes, you can. Halfway, finish it, double. Come on, it's single. Single, yes, and the double for five, four, three, two, and one. Whew. Holy bananas, circuit one. I don't know how many times I said holy bananas and we are not even 10 minutes into the workout. <laughs> Grab your water. <laughs> Grab your water, take a beat. Pulses, what are they, Rachel? You tell me, Lynn. You're the expert here. <laughs> okay. I'm just along for the ride. Pulses, we got dry peas, we got lentils, we got chickpeas, we have lupins, we have fava beans. Am I missing anything? Fava beans, lentils, chickpeas, dry peas. I think that's it, those are our pulses. What's your favorite of that, of that what chick I just peas. listed up? I love chickpeas, I love them so much. I'm with you, I'd say chickpeas and lentils. Yeah. Chickpeas and lentils, they're just so versatile. You can put them in anything. So versatile, okay, legs, legs, okay? And because I got a bad leg, you get to do isometric holds. Yes, get excited. I'm gonna do isometric holds with my body weight. Rachel's gonna take one dumbbell to her chest. You could take two dumbbells and rack them at the side. You're gonna make it as hard as you want, okay? It's an isometric hold, let's go right leg forward, left leg back. You're just gonna hold a lunge for 30 seconds. Your option is to pop that front heel down and up. Give me a calf raise on that front leg. It's an isometric hold for 30 seconds. Then you're gonna load up the weights. We're gonna go into a single leg deadlift, okay? Load up the weights how you choose and then we go right into it again. Yes? Let's go. Right leg forward, left leg back. Isometric lunge hold, no weight. One weight, weight's at your side. Get low, we go. In three, two, one. Option A, hold here. You're just holding an isometric lunge. Option B, lift that front heel, lower it. Lift and lower. If you're gonna add weights, it's gonna get harder, right? Okay? If you say you have knee pain during lunges, Yes, I'm with you now. I never understood that, but then I had knee surgery, tore my meniscus. Now I get knee pain. Isometric holds are a great place to start before you get into that full lunge, right? Isometric holds, build strength, time under tension. Like you got five. Too. Yes, so much control. So much control. Three, two, one, you're out, stand it up. I'm gonna grab my 15s, because I'm still getting strength back in this right leg, okay? Single leg deadlift, single leg deadlift. Option stagger, option float, three. Two, let's go. So I'm crushing oranges in my armpits. I say that on every deadlift, but it's just the cue that works. It helps. Right? Option, float that other leg back. Option, stagger it like Rachel. You're thinking about driving through the heel of that right leg to stand you tall. Working the hamstring, back of the leg, hamstring glute. Also really engaged here is your back. People don't know that. Your lats are engaged because you're holding the weights close to you. Your low back is turned on because it's part of your posterior chain that's helping stand you up. Super important muscles right here. Like, that's a great cue that helps because people talk about getting uh, back pain on deadlifts, right? Right. So that orange cue helps so much. It helps keep those weights tight to the body. Really want to think about having a soft bend in that standing leg too. Nice. Right here, guys. Finish these deadlifts for five, four, three, two. Give me one more. Ooh, still working on that balance. So challenging. All right, isometric lunge hold. You can go one weight, two weight, no weight. Left leg forward, right leg back. Lunge it in three, two. Get low, hold that lunge. Option hold here. Option front heel, lift and lower. Lift and lower. You're thinking about how close you can get that back knee to the mat. I'm modifying a little bit right here. 
because this knee is my bad leg. Come on, come on. Lift and lower. It's that time under tension. We call it the slow burn, Rachel. Oh my gosh. The embrace the shake. I think of that too. Embrace the shake. It's a slow burn, guys. Slow burn. You want to make it harder. Grab those weights. Hold them right here. Yes. Come on. Yes, you can get low. Can you drop an inch for five, four, three, two, and one. Nice. Same thing, we switch it out. Go from the top, right leg forward, isometric lunge hold, right back into it. Isometric lunge hold in three, set it up, right foot forward, in two, and one. Hold that lunge, option, lift that front heel. Lift and lower. Little calf raise action, also good for that knee health. You're gonna get a lot of knee health and push-ups in 2023. Push up the knee health. If you're here for it, hit subscribe to the there YouTube channel. Let's go. Come on. Not, all, not always moves we like to do. But important, right? Very stinking important. Yes, get low, get low for five, four, three, two, one more calf raise Woo! and you're out. Yes, okay, nice work guys. Single leg deadlift, other leg, left leg is on the ground. Option, right leg floats or staggers. Deadlift, hinge it in three, two, one. Also something that really helps me with this, think about initiating with a hip hinge. Instead of just thinking about dropping those weights down the front side of the leg, think about initiating with a hip hinge. I know Rachel likes the cue. Shoot your butt back behind you like you're closing a car do. door. Here you go. Nice work. One rep at a time. 45 seconds on move B. It's slow and steady, guys. Move B is slow and steady. Isn't that crazy how much better this feels than push-ups, though? <laughs> oh, <laughs> I'm with you there. Push-ups out of the way. Balance. Done. Come I'm on, glad Lizzie. we did that in circuit one. Right? I'm gonna get them out while you're fresh. Goal is to come back and do this workout all the way. 10 seconds with push-ups from my toes. Nice work. Come on, team. Come on, team. Five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work. Isometric lunge hold. Left leg forward, right leg back. It's the final lunge hold, and you're done with circuit two. That flew. That flew. Three, two, get low, get low. Hold it here. Option, lift that heel. Take it up and down. It's 30 seconds. It's your, actually, it's not your final isometric lunge hold. I'm just going to tell you that. Uh oh. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert. Spoiler alert, we have some burnouts coming at the end of the workout that's gonna require another isometric lunge hold. Woo! But the thing about repeating a move is you fatigue the muscle group and you get better at it. Yes, let's go, let's go, get low. Come on right here, it's five. Yes, four, and three, two, one. Stand it up, shake out those legs. Woo! Oofta. Nice little fire, I didn't even use a weight and I feel that. All right, water up. Circuit three is back to the arms. But we are gonna go pull muscles, okay? That's my back and my biceps, back and biceps. Move one is a single, single, double back row. Okay, narrow grip, palms face in. Single, single, double. And then we're gonna go reverse grip for the second time we do it. And your third move in between is bicep curls. So it looks like this, move one. Single, single, double, palms face in. And then you're gonna go right into bicep curls. I'm gonna hold halfway and I'm gonna curl for three. Then I'm gonna switch it. You ready, Rach? Let's go. Single, single, double. Go heavy here if you can. All right. Back rows, largest muscle in the upper body. Soft bend in the knees. Hinge it over, punch to the gut. Roll the shoulders down and back. We go in three, two. Let's roll, let's go. Go right, go left, go together. Double. Pull right, pull left, pull double. Nice. Right, left, and double it up. Go right. And left, it's 30 seconds on these back rows. I'm thinking about pulling elbow to hip. Nice, not pulling from the wrist, pulling from the elbow. Pull from the elbow, 10 seconds, guys. Whew. Nice, single, single, double, final three, two, and one. Nice, you're gonna keep it right here. Let's bring that right arm up to a half curl. Left arm is gonna go full range curl, palms face out, shoulders down and back, half curl. We go in three, two, let's go. Curl for three. Two, one, hold the left arm halfway, right arm all the way down, all the way up for three. Two, switch it again, hold it halfway. So one bicep is under constant tension, yes? Yes, you feel it, Rach? Those isometric holds, <laughs> they'll get ya. Woo! It's that slow burn, baby, that slow burn. Two, and three, switch it out. Move two is your longer move. So this is your endurance move, right? You got 45 seconds, which feels longer than 30, right? You can feel it but you only got to do this move twice versus move A, you do four times. Come on, you got 10 seconds left here. 10 seconds to fatigue those biceps. This is where the weight should feel heavy. If they don't, you got to pick up heavier weights, guys. Let's go three, 
two, and one. Whew. Quick set down, quick shake out. Back to single, single, double. This time reverse grip, palms pick out. Single, single, double back row. Grab them, we go in three, two. Let's go, row right, row left. Give me the double, double. Row right, row left. Now, this is what we would call an endurance strength workout, okay? So you might not be able to go as heavy as you normally do in strength workouts with longer rest. If you wanna hit pause and give yourself a longer break so you can lift heavier, you do that, okay? Great option. This is high volume. That means a lot of reps with short rest. So typically you might use, I'm using 15s. Right now I would normally use 20s on my back row. Three, two, set it down, shake it out. Back to rows, but you're gonna go palms back in. Single, single, double on the rows. How are we doing, Rachel? Let's go. Let's go, finish it, come on, hinge it. Single, single, double, palms face in. Three, two, let's row, let's row. 30 seconds, single, single, double. A lot of reps, right? High volume in the reps. Nice. Reps is volume. Intensity is increasing the weights. Density is the amount of reps that we are getting into this short workout. This is a very volume dense workout. Mm. Come on, you got it. Row, row, double them up right here. Come on, yes, it's five, four, three, two. You're out, Sum down. I gotta shake out that grip. All right, 45 seconds. Isometric bicep hold, curl for three. Let's hold the right arm, or sorry, left arm halfway in three. Two, hold your left arm halfway, right arm curls, curl for three. Two, one, switch it out. All the way down, all the way up on the left. Two, and one. Nice, can you think about keeping those elbows in line or slightly in front of the body? Keep tension off those shoulders. Switch it out. Yes, you got it. Curl. Woo! Two. How you feeling, Rach? My little You're heart. halfway. You are so much stronger than you think. Come on, stick with it. So strong. I don't know if you guys noticed when Rachel started doing these workouts, which was originally not in the job description, no. by the way. What were you using? Like tens, like ten, fives, maybe? Yeah, she's crushing I mean. it, you guys. Strength gains for five, four, three, two, and one. Woo! Woo! Set it down. Holy bananas. Reverse grip row for the final circuit. Reverse grip, and you get that water break in three. Two palms face me, let's row. Right, left, come on, double it up. 30 seconds right here. That water break is on the other side and we go back to legs. Those baby arms get a break, right? We like that. Row, row, come on, double it up. Yes, you got this team. Row, row, nice. Something about that single, single, double format that I really like too. Yeah. Breaks up the cadence. 10 seconds, guys. Let's go, finish it. Right here, it's five. Four, three, two, you're out. Set them down. Woo, shake it off. Holy bananas. Grab your water. We go back to legs. Okay, guys, legs. We're gonna do some squats. We're gonna do standard 80 20 squats, and then we're gonna do some lateral squats. Add a little lateral movement in there for you. I'm gonna modify as I need to for my knee. Rachel's gonna load up those weights and get after it, okay? Do where you're at. Okay, Rachel, favorite. Recipe you make with pulses. Okay, I make chickpeas. I make it all the time in the summer. Chickpeas, chopped up tomatoes, chopped up cucumber, chopped up red onion, a little red wine vinegar, a little olive oil. So good. I eat it as a salad all summer long. Stay tuned. You'll be seeing that recipe on NMA. We'll make it. <laughs> Nourishmentlove.com. Grab your weights. Grab your weights. All right, let's start right leg forward. Left toe popped. I'm going to go one left dumbbell because this is my, my weak leg. All right, so 80% is in my right leg, 20% is in my back left toe. Okay, option loaded up like Rachel with two. I'm gonna go one. I'm gonna go 80, 20 squat, down up. I'm gonna give you a shorter range of motion. Rachel's gonna get that nice deep range of motion. Do what you're at. Okay, it's 30 seconds, 80, 20 squat. Think of it as a single leg squat for your right leg, right? Left leg is just kickstand to help you out. We go in three, two, let's go. Down, up, down. Nice work team, really think about driving through that right heel. Nice, I want my right knee to stay in line or even go out towards my outer three toes. Not caving in, don't let that knee cave in. Yes, nice work, nice work. Woo, you got it. It's amazing how quick you lose muscle. This is so hard for my right leg. About 10 weeks, I haven't really done a true squat. Loaded up with weight. I don't know if I'm even cleared to really do this yet by my doctors, but here we are. Three, uh -oh. two, one, push your pace, right? Challenge yourself. All right, lateral squat, I'm gonna go no weight. Rachel's got one goblet in the middle. We're gonna hit just right, so I'm gonna go here. So lateral squat, toes face me or slightly out. We're gonna hit just right for 45 seconds. In three, two, let's go. I'm gonna hit right. Nice, so I'm thinking about driving off this bent knee. 
really using my gluteus medius, my outer glute. Nice, awesome job. Just hit right, drive center. It's technically, you'd think it's a lateral lunge, but it's a squat because my feet stay planted. If I step back together to center, that's a lunge. Feet are planted, it's a squat. I think because your feet are staying planted, you can typically load it up here and go a little heavier. Right, you're taking that balance aspect out. Hit it, stand it. Think about really driving off that bent knee. Bend, extend, drive, nice. Decelerate, accelerate. 10 seconds, guys, 10 seconds. Let's go, team. Woo. Five, four, three, two, and one. We're gonna go 80-20 squat. We're gonna stand that right leg, so you're gonna burn it out. Right leg, right leg forward. We'll do left leg for the second set. Right leg forward, left toe pop. 80-20 squat in three, two, let's go. Back to it, squat it out. Nice work, Rach. Awesome job, you got 30 seconds. You go two on the right, two on the left. Come on, come on. Goal is to really dig into that right leg right here. Come on, come on. Nice work, team. You can always slow down the pace. You choose your pace, you choose your weight. Yes, what would it look like if I said 10 more seconds right here? Down, up, stay in it. Come on, it's five, four, three, two, give me one more. Nice, you're gonna switch it out. So now left leg comes forward, right toe goes popped. I'm going back to 80-20 squat, okay? Same thing, 80-20 squat, we're gonna stay on the left leg this time. Three, two, let's go, this is your 30 seconds. Right here, down, up, down, up. Nice work, awesome job team. Nice. Can we talk about the cardio I feel like we're getting right now too? <laughs> right? Like, this is not a cardio workout, but <laughs> no, my sweatiness would not tell you that. <laughs> because of the endurance format, right? Very short rest time. If you want to strength train and raise your heart rate, shorten the rest time. That's density of work. The density is going to pick up that heart rate. Three, two, one. Lateral squat. You're going to hit just left. Hit just left. Toes face me or slightly out. Just bending into that right or left leg. In three, two, let's go. 45 seconds. Hit. Nice. Hit. Come on. Down. Up. Drive off that bent leg. Control the down. Explode up. Control the down. Explode up. Yes. There we go. Push. Big, strong legs. Strengthening those movements side to side. Right here. Nice work, team. Stay with it. You got this. Woo! You can do anything for 45 seconds, it's right? It's crazy how long 45 seconds feels compared to 30, though. Right? And you're just like, it's not that big of a difference, but it feels that like one. <laughs> seconds. That after you're in that extra 15. You're in the final 10, 9, 8. Let's go. Stay with me. It's 5, 4, 3, 2, and 1. Nice, load up that left leg one more time, 80-20 squat. Left leg forward, right toe popped. Final time on the 80-20. We go in three, two, let's go, nice. After this, guys, it's total body. Total Last body. Last circuit, right? Last circuit. Circuit five of five. It is a 30 minute full body dumbbell workout that is gonna strengthen and raise your heart rate, right, Rachel? Woo! We love it, efficient, right? Efficient, we are all about quick and effective workouts here. At NML, nice. And you can refuel with some high protein, high fiber pulses. Yes. Love that. Lots of nutritional benefits. Nice. Five, four, three, two, one more. And you're out. Nice. Awesome job. I'm going to keep my weights right here. I'm going to grab my weights. We are going down into circuit five. Let's grab some water quick. Give you a water break. Circuit five is a real burner. You're going to put most of the moves you've done today all into one, right? That's what we call the woman maker. The woman maker. Technically known as the man maker, we made it the woman maker here at NML. All right, you're gonna get me. <laughs> Grab your weights if you want to. Rachel's gonna show you a standing version, okay? So I'm gonna do a push up, she's just gonna hinge over. It's a push up, it's a row, a row. I'm gonna step my feet in, come up, she's gonna squat. I'm just standing up, curl, push. I'm gonna take it down, okay? So we're gonna move at different paces. Push up, row, row, come in, curl, press. You can squat. I'm gonna do a little bit more of a deadlift because of my knee. Okay, Rachel's giving you the row, row from a standing position. Standing options, take it to the ground, push up row, row, you're doing it for 30 seconds. And then from there, you're gonna go into another lunge hold. A lunge hold with one dumbbell, finding a halo. I'm gonna give you the modification, standing halo. Rachel's gonna give you the lunge hold, yes? Yep, let's do it. All right, we're flipping flopping today. All right, here we go. Find it, it's 30 seconds, woman maker. This is your chance, guys, circuit five. If you got gas in the tank, Turn up the intensity. Let's go. It's Give it 30 all. seconds. 
finish strong. We go in three, two, let's go. Push up for me, row, row, step in or squat it. Here we go, curl, push your pace, your tempo. It's your 30 seconds. You make the most of it right here. Come on, it's a big move. It's a big move. It's putting everything we've done today together. Make the most of it. Let's go, let's go team. You got this, stick in it. Come on, you can do anything for 30 seconds. Yes, you can, especially if it's the last circuit. Last circuit of the workout. Five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work. Awesome job. Rachel's gonna find a lunge hold. Lunge hold with a halo. Why don't you go right foot forward, left foot yep. back. You're gonna find that lunge hold and you're gonna do a halo. Halo, halo. I'm gonna do the same thing from a split stance. Right here, it's 45 seconds. Let's start dumbbell here. We go halo in three, two, let's go. Rachel's gonna challenge her, her legs. I like my balance. Core. Right, Ooh. halo. Shoulder mobility, standing core, off the floor. Woo, hip to hip, think hip, around the head, hip, around the head, hip. Come on, hello core. Everything's working right here, and it's the longer 45 seconds. So it's a burn, right, Rach? You're telling me. <laughs> How are those legs Woo! doing? Right? They're talking to me. They're talking. That core, that balance training, it's all coming into play. Here's that extra 15 seconds. That extra 15 seconds, you're in it. 10 seconds, come on guys, finish it. Let's go. Yes, you can. Five, four, three, two, and one. Nice work, Rage. You got the standing, I got the woman maker from the floor. Push up, row, row. We're there. In three, two, Let's go, push up, row, row, step or jump in, up to you. Come on, curl, push, your pace, your tempo. You got 30 seconds, 30 seconds to push your pace right here. Come on, come on. This is your final circuit. I know it's hard, I know you're tired. We're right there alongside you. We're doing this with you guys, every rep. Come on, come on. Yes, Rachel, finish it. You got five, four, Three, two, one more push up because we're working on there you them. Go. Woo! From the top. 10 second rest right back into those woman makers. Woman makers. How are we doing? Last time, right? Just one more. You hear the heavy breathing, guys. Here we go. Woman makers, tighten your ponytails. We go. In three, two, one. Woo! Who said you needed to jump around to get a good workout? Come on. Strength training right here. Crushing it, guys. One rep at a time. Crushing it, Lindsay. Look at you. Oh, trying to come back after this knee surgery. Humbling in its own respect. It's like I was postpartum, then I had the knee. Woo! You do your best. I'll do my best. We'll all cheer each other on for three, two, and one. All right, lunge hold. Left leg forward. Right leg back, auction. Staggered stance with me. Take the weight to the right hip. Halo, 45 second hold, you ready? Let's go. <laughs> let's go, three, two, let's go, Halo. Hip to hip, your pace, your tempo. Come on, holding that lunge is really challenging for your core, isn't it, Rachel? It's so tough. You have to really be thinking about it. Nice work. This is where the heavy breathing sets in. This is where the mental toughness comes in, guys. You wanna be done, but you're not. You're so close. You got about a minute and third, you got about one minute of work left. One minute of work left between this and the woman maker. Come on, finish it. Here's that extra 15 seconds. Work for it. Work for it. Make yourself proud right here. Come on. End of that workout. So strong. That's what you are. For five, four, three, two, and one. Woo. You ready, Rach? Let's go. You ready? Last one move. more set Come of on. woman makers. One more. And it starts in three. Two, let's go, push up, woo, row, row. We're bringing the intensity today. We're bringing it in a big full body sweat sesh. Woo, come on, come on. Yes, you can. Woo, that stretch is on the other side. Oh, that's that gonna stretch feel is good. on the other side. It's gonna feel so good. Come on, what would it look like if I said 10 more seconds here? 10 more seconds here. Yes, woo, five, four, Three, two, and one. There you go. Woo! Holy bananas. There you go, Lindsay. Circuit one, three, five. Circuit one, three, five. 
I wasn't loading up the lower body as much, so those are the circuits that got me. Woo! How are you feeling, Rach? Sweaty. Sweaty. But done. But done. Done. Best part. Woo! On the other side, let's stretch it out, team. Let's stretch it out. Okay. We're gonna go. Let's start standing. Can you balance on your left foot? Pull your right heel to your glute. I'm giving you a go for my calf. That's all I got with this knee mobility and hinge and reach. Nice little quad stretch, warrior three. Little mobility challenge. Because mobility is taking your muscles through the full range of motion with control. This is control. Woo! Switch it out. Standing on your right leg. Left heel comes to the glute. Nice little warrior three quad stretch. Catch your breath. Woo! You guys crushed it. I'm just so proud of you. Flap the wings. Flap the wings. Let's go. Big inhale, arms behind the back, chest expansion. Remember those push-ups we did in that first set? Barely. It seems like so long ago. <laughs> Take the hands over to the right hip, gaze over your left shoulder. Right? We crushed them. Nice. Take it back. Big chest expansion. Other side. Up and over. Gaze over. Nice work, you guys. All right. Great way to add some pulses to your diet, you guys. Salads. Smoothies. I love throwing it in pasta, too. Oh, that's Chick a good idea. Chickpeas go really good in pasta. Sure. Lentils go really good in pasta. If you feel good about your heart rate, big inhale up. Exhale forward fold. Just take it down. Let it all hang heavy right here. Nice. Just shake out those knees. Little, little wobbly side to side. Nice. Can you plant your hands on the ground? Step back. Let's go down to a quadruped position on all fours if you can. Drop the belly. Nice. And reverse it. Also, we were talking about baking. Have you ever baked with chickpeas? My college roommate used to make brownies. You Blend can make, them up. Like, it tastes like, it's like the best cookie dough. If you make cookie dough with chickpeas, we'll have to find a recipe for you, you guys. make that. That so sounds great. Actually, you know where you can find these recipes. <laughs> you know where you can find Let's just go over here. But I've been loving a good wide leg forward fold lately. So take your feet out nice and wide. And then you're going to slowly just reach yourself forward right here. This feels good. Hang out right here. All right, you guys, you know where you can find these recipes? Actually, our friends at the Northern Pulse Growers Association have a website, northernpulse.com. Northernpulse.com. You're going to be able to find more recipes that are lentil friendly. Uh, or that are lentil friendly. <laughs> I had lentils on my mind. That's what I've been making lately. I've been making these little lentil balls, like little taco balls or little lentil pizza balls for my eight month old. Aww. So lentils are a staple in our house because. He loves them. <laughs> so when I find a food that my eight month old likes, we all like it. <laughs> so lentils are a big hit in our house right now. But you can find more pulse recipes at northernpulse.com. They got lots of good recipes for you. Bring it in. Here we go. You're going to take your legs, bend at 90 degrees. Fingertips are going to face your butt. You're going to bridge up and you're going to take a nice reverse tabletop. Let the neck and shoulders just hang heavy. Think about spreading those chest muscles apart, lifting those hips high, opening the chest, opening the front side of the body. Hold for three, two, one, sit it back down. Awesome work, Rach. Way to go, Lindsay. So proud of you guys. And you guys, if you do not celebrate, you should now put on your calendar. February 10th is World Pulses Day. Yes. So on February 10th, we'll be sharing, maybe on February 10th, we'll be sharing Rachel's infamous salad recipe. Okay, perfect. We'll all Deal. be eating it, right? <laughs> February 10th, World Pulses Day. It's a great way to recognize the importance of pulses from a, as a global food. I mean, I think they're enjoyed like everywhere yeah. around the world. So. Awesome job, you guys. And thanks so much to Northern Pulse Growers Association for sponsoring this workout. We love sweating with you, and we'll see you back soon. Thanks so much for joining me for that full body workout. If you loved it, hit subscribe to that YouTube channel, and you can find another strength workout just like it right here, or find all of our strength workouts in this playlist right here. Have a great day.